Let's convert the decimal 0.25 to a fraction where we have the numerator divided by the denominator. You can think of 0.25 as 0.25 over 1. It's the same thing, it's just we divided by 1 and now we have the start of a fraction. If we have two decimal places here, so we have one, two decimal places, if we multiply this number by 100, that'll give us a whole number. So let's multiply this by 100. And 100 times 0 0.25, that's just 25. But 25, that's not equal to 0 0.25. So what we need to do is multiply the bottom by 100 as well. So now 100 over 100, that's the same as 1. So we're not changing the value here, just the way it's represented. 100 times 1, that is 100. Now we have a fraction. We can simplify the fraction. 25 goes into itself one time, and 25 goes into 100 four times. So 25 over 100, that's the same as 1 fourth. So we've taken the decimal, 0 0.25, and we've expressed that as a fraction, 1 fourth. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.